What's going on guys? Cooks46 here bringing you a brand new video. I wanted to let you guys know about the new event that's coming into MLB The Show tomorrow called the Time Warp Event. So on the shownation.com it was announced that the new event will be starting tomorrow and the description says the fourth Diamond Dynasty event in the show 17 will be the Time Warp Event. Assemble a team of only legends and flashbacks. The event allows any tier of player but your team overall is limited to 80. So you could have gold, you could have diamonds, you could have all the good dudes you want, but your team is limited to 80, so you can't go too hard, you can't have like a ton of diamonds, you can't have a ton of golds, like you gotta, you know, pick and choose where you wanna have your good guys and stuff like that, so 80 overall limit. Of course, this event is gonna be free to enter like they all are, and this event starts tomorrow, June 7th at noon Pacific time and ends uh, June 14th at 12 pacific time so it goes for a full week which is actually really good because these are six inning games so the games are going to take a little bit longer and you need 40 cumulative wins to get the top cumulative win reward so 40 times six think about that that's 240 innings of just games that you win that's not counting any games that you might lose or any extra inning games so 240 innings of you winning like that's gonna be a lot. So everything for this event is gonna work exactly the same. Like I said, free to enter. Uh, it's double elimination, just like the last time. So let's go over what the possible rewards are that you can get from playing in this event. We're gonna start with the cumulative rewards and then we're gonna go to the win streak rewards. So the first five win cumulative reward guarantees you a bronze live series player. The 10 win cumulative reward is a guaranteed live series silver. The 25 win cumulative is an impact veteran Luke Gregerson, 85 overall gold, and the 40 win cumulative reward, all-star flashback Robinson Cano, diamond, 96 overall. So here's a look at the Luke Gregerson card, 85 overall gold impact veteran from 2012. The first thing that should stand out to you is the 99 break. He's got a slider, he's got a two seam, he's got a cutter, so he's got some pitches that move a little bit, but the 60 velocity is okay. I'm pretty sure this card was in MLB 16, if I do remember correctly. I could be wrong about that, but I feel like I recognize that card art. But 85 hits through 9, 79 strikeouts per 9. So this is a nice little gold impact veteran reliever if you might need something, but he might not be the absolute best and here is a big one guys 96 overall all-star from the 2012 season Robinson Cano second baseman middle infielder that's very very big right there 99 98 against righties absolutely demolishes right-handed pitching 56 or 59 45 versus lefties is a little bit shaky but this is very similar to the Curtis Granderson card uh, I think Granderson has more speed but this is, it's similar. He's got really good fielding, obviously one of the best fielding uh, second baseman you can have in Robinson Cano, back to when he was playing with the Yankees. So really, really good card right here, guys. Brand new diamond, flashback Robinson Cano. So now let's move on to the win streak rewards. So the three win streak that you get is a guaranteed bronze. Uh, the six win streak is a guaranteed silver player. The 10 win streak is an impact veteran legend, George Brett, an 88 overall gold. And the 12 win streak is an all-star flashback, Russell Martin, 94 overall diamond catcher. So here is a look at the George Brett card, guys. He is a first baseman who can play secondary positions of left and right field, 88 overall gold. Uh, his contact numbers are really good, 95, 92. The vision also is stellar at 92, 85 clutch. This dude is a nice gold hitter. The power is a little bit lower than what I like the fielding is average the speed is average to below average so this card is, is a solid player but he's not going to be somebody you want to really just like go crazy over because obviously there's a better George Brett in the game and here we are with the 94 overall 2007 all-star Russell Martin 65 95 contact 56 84 power 79 vision 84 discipline really good fielding great blocking that's an important stat this year and you know average speed but still for me this card would not start over Victor Martinez like Victor Martinez is an absolute beast yeah say whatever you want about the defense I will trade that defense for an absolute beast at the plate able to swing the bat from both sides switch hitter so I don't have to worry about a platoon so overall this Ru Russell Mont card doesn't it doesn't wow me it doesn't like you know make me crazy I remember this card I think was an MLB 16 as well they, it, they introduced this card pretty late in the year and I think the stats were pretty similar so overall 
this card doesn't wow me. I think the best reward out of this event is the Robinson Cano. But yeah, guys, that is the event info for this upcoming time warp event it seems like a really fun event to me only using flashbacks only using legends i mean ma mainly my team is flashbacks and legends i don't have a lot of live series on my actual team but it's really cool to see like a bunch of old school cards being used unfortunately i won't be able to play much of it and i don't see myself getting the robinson cano probably not the russell martin i, I don't even know how many of rewards i'm going to get from this event because this event is going to go through the weekend and it'll be monday tuesday wednesday where i can actually get the most play time out of it but i'm going to be at ea play this weekend with a bunch of other MLB YouTubers so probably not a lot of us are going to get a lot of time on this event so hopefully I can play a little bit and give you guys some content for it but yeah guys that is all the information for this event let me know down in the comments what you think are you excited for this event are you going to play it do you like the rewards let me know all your thoughts down underneath but guys that is going to do it for this video really hope you enjoyed if you did you know what to do drop a like down underneath this video make sure you guys subscribe so you never miss any more mlb the show videos guys that's all i have for you in this one so i hope you enjoyed it. and until the next one i will see you later